Thank you for coming in. I wanted to give you the heads up that Renee Lee testified before a grand jury today. It's pretty damning. Renee. I see clearly now how she led me to temptation. She's no innocent. She used her life body, her suggestive smile to lure me to her. No different from Bathsheba bathing on the rooftop 20 yards from Kim David. So you didn't assault her? I would never assault anyone. More of a seduction. You got that right. Getting all gussied up every time I came over to tutor her? She entrapped me. Why else would she video her and, and then lie to me that she deleted the only copy? She's the one who should be charged here with extortion. Yeah, maybe. But she was underage. A jury will look at her and then at me and decide for themselves. I hear you. And, and to be honest, I'd, I'd be nervous if I didn't have two other girls from the church who also testified to the exact same pattern of grooming, seduction, and sexual predation. Are these girls are underage? All of them. At the start. By the time they turn 17, the good reverend here, well, he seems to get tempted by a younger girl. They're setting me up. It's got to be part of a coordinated shakedown. They know the church has money. Someone must have got to them. Delman. Your client's right. Someone did meet with them. To extort money from the church? No. To give them permission to tell the truth without fear of reprisal from you. I demand to know who in my congregation would plot against me. There's no plot, Reverend. She was seeking their forgiveness. She? Your wife. Laura, I, you turned her against me. <laughs> now you did that. And she'll never forgive herself for what happened to those girls.